everybody, this is Toadette Girl 20 and welcome to the final episode for now of Mario Power Tennis. We are going to be covering the special games. So yep, we're gonna be just we're gonna be showing off every single special game in this game with different characters. So we have so we have artists on the court and those ones. So here are all the different games that we are gonna be showing off. I will so yeah. We're will be different characters for each of these, so I'm very excited. So these two right here, I am not going to be covering. We're just going to be sticking with artists on the court. I don't really see the need for the other two. I don't even know what they do, to be honest. But we're just going to do artists on the court. So here we go. We're going to be Peach coloring Mario's painting, which is nice. Okay, so keep in mind, I am way better at the Wii version of the special games than the GameCube version. So I may be struggling, but guys, keep in mind, I'm playing on an emulator, so I might struggle. And also, I have not played this game on GameCube in a while, so that's another reason why I might struggle. So keep that in mind. All that matters is I am just... If I do if I do lose at some of the games, just remember that I'm at least showing it off on video. Let me look at the controls. So yeah. Even if I lose, it's okay. I tried my best, and at least I'm showing it off on video. That's all that matters. So I'm just looking at the controls. L, A, lunge, L, E, B, or L plus B. I, that means at the same time, I think. L, cancel, charge. What's that? I'm not sure. So I believe in the game, in the Wii version, the Wii version's easier because your character moves automatically and you're easy, easily able to hit them good. And they don't give you like so many spots. I think in the Wii version, the eyes are colored in with the with the blue Mario name, I, I believe, I think. That's what I think it is. Oh, hold on, let me look at the again. Wait, let me look at, no, not the rolls. A, top spin, B, slice. Um, control stick move, a, a mode with no power shots. <clears throat> um, I'll just try my best here. Oh, come on, I'm trying the lunge thing. Okay, I got one of the eyes. Can I get the other one, though? <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, good! I got both eyes! Sweet. Okay, now we just need the hat, the nose, the mustache, and I guess we're all set. Okay, okay, I got the, I got the nose, just need the mustache and the hat. Oh yeah, we also need the white. Oh, I got it! Okay, I just need... The hat and the white. The white that's where the M is. Those are the only ones I need. I hope I can get those. <clears throat> Come on, we got this. Come on, we got this. I don't know why she's like tripping. I don't get I don't understand. I'm trying some of these controls. So this um this course takes place in Peach Dome, by the looks of it. And I love the theme for this. I love the theme for this special games music because um it's a it's a re it's a remix of the castle theme from Super Mario 64, which is nice. It's a very nice one. Oh my god, come on. Also in the Wii version, I think you're given 10 minutes instead of 5 minutes. I think. There are some changes. I could explain if if as long as I do have the Wii version, as long as I remember what the changes are. Oh yeah, the, the picture down below tells you what color the thing is. And when it lights up, it tells you which one it's going to get painted, if you get it correctly. <clears throat> Basically. Oh, come on, I had that. I'm just hoping I can just... I, I haven't played this in a while. I'm just trying to figure this out. Come on, we got this. Come on. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. We've got this. Come on, come on. Dang it, come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh my god. I'm trying so hard. 
Oh, uh, hold on. Uh. Okay, A, B, lob, B, A, drop shot. A, B, flat, A, B, flat shot. A, A. Hold on. A, B, lob, B, A, drop shot. A plus B, flat shot. A, A is strong topspin. All right, I'll try. They're just the different kind of shots you can do. Uh, sorry, I gotta look at it once again. A, B, lob, B, A, drop shot. A plus B, flat shot. A, A, strong, sh strong top spin. B, B is strong slice. L plus B or L plus A, manual lunge. A, A, B, okay, then that's all of them on the bottom screen then. Just trying to get that, trying, I'm just trying to... just trying to get that red hat. I'm trying to get the hat and the M. That's what I'm trying to do, but I'm struggling. We might, I don't think we're going to be able to get it. Oh, come on. There's got to be a way to try to aim for the top. I'm just trying to remember how to do it. Um... I'm tr like, I'm standing in the spot where I want it, but I don't know. I think the special games in the Wii version are way easier to beat. <clears throat> but <clears throat> since this game came out on the GameCube first, um, that's why, pretty much why, uh, it's nice how Mario Power Tennis, oh, nope, we didn't complete it. I'm sorry, guys. I tried my best. That stinks. Sorry, guys. I tried my best. Well, um, let's go on to the next special game. Let me see what it is. I forgot. Okay, it's Terra Tennis, so we'll be Luigi. Sure. Hopefully, we can win this one. Maybe I'll redo that one at some point. Alright. So, here we have Terra Tennis. Basically... I, I pretty much explained in like part one or two how to play the mini games, but I'll explain it again. Basically, you have to prevent ghosts from coming out of the paintings. When the ghost is about to come out, you'll get five points. Regular hitting ghosts will give you one, and then when they're slightly about to come out, I think you're rewarded two or three points. Ghosts can escape and they can chase after you, so you might want to be careful. And it's nice how a ghost can even throw a ball at you too. So yeah, Mario Power Tennis is just one of those games where it got a Wii version, along with Donkey Kong Jungle Beat. It was only those two games. They must have been special or something to get a Wii version. Well, that's how it is with Donkey Kong Country, Tropical Freeze, Captain Toad, Treasure Tracker, Super Mario 3D World, Super Mario, well, Super Mario Maker, it, well, it doesn't count because it's Super Mario Maker 2, but... Oh my god, go, stay away from me. Okay, that timer is really short. We are going to try that. There's no way. We're going to try that again. How do we fail already? Let's go ahead and try that again. That was too short. No, I did not want exhibition. Yeah, apparently... Oh, yeah, it's one minute. So you have to. I have to get 50 ghosts in under a minute? Really? Dang, that seems... That seems challenging. It's only the first level. Why am I failing, though? Doesn't make any sense. Okay. Oh, now I was able to make the ball go up. Yeah, maybe I'll come back to Artist on the Court. I don't know. Maybe at the end for as a bonus little footage. I'll think about it. <clears throat> mm, come on. Oh my god, the blue ghost got me. Come on, leave me alone. Okay. Oh my god, time's almost up. Come on, come on, come on! 
Come on, we got this. Come on. Come on. Oh, yes. Oh, thank God. There were only three seconds left. That was close. So, yeah, there's Terra Tennis for you. We actually beat it. We're not going to play the other ones. I might struggle with them still. If I were playing on an actual GameCube, I'd probably do good. I don't know. All right, let's go on to the next special game. All right, I believe next is uh, Tic Tac Low. We'll be Yoshi because we have not seen Yoshi anywhere else during our Let's Play. So we are definitely going to be showing off Yoshi here. Definitely Yoshi and Koopa because we have not seen them at all. All right, so here's Tic Tac Low. It is held on the Delfino Plaza Court. So basically, again, what you have to do is you have to try to uncover the shine sprites. It's like tic-tac-toe, but different. So you have to try to un- Oh, that was a bad throw. You have to try to uncover the shine sprites to get points. So we have six points. The goal is to try to get to 50 for in like two minutes. So, and it's funny because remember, look, the timer's displayed on the actual court, like I mentioned before. Sometimes Flood will squirt out a giant, a giant, like, water ball, and it'll make three of them come out. And I like that. So, all right, we are at 20. We, we need 30 more. 30 more points until we win. Come on, we got this. And there's little pea piranhas around surrounding the court as well, so that's pretty nice. All right, come on, come on. Come on, we can make it. And there's also Piantas watching us, and I like how one of them's playing a guitar like they did in the original game. Oh my god. Come on, we can do this. Oh my god, we have a minute left. Oh no. Can we make it, please? Also, you have to go to where the flood is about to square. You have to stand on the, like, the button. Oh my god, we're so close. Come on, come on. Yeah, sorry the games tend to, some of them tend to be short. Oh my god. Come on. Okay, two more, two more, two more, two more, two more. We got this. Come on, yes! I like how the, com I like how the word complete dances like that. It's hilarious. That's really funny. Exactly 50 points, nice. So yep, that was Tic Tac Low. It was nice showing Yoshi off. We have not seen, he w did not appear at all when I did tournament mode for some reason. A lot of them kept being repeats of the same characters. Okay, next is Chain Chomp Challenge. I'm gonna be boo for this one. So Chain Chomp Challenge, I already explained, but I guess I'll explain. We have Peckish Chomp. All right, so let's see. Ooh, Wiggler's here, yay! Yay, my boy Wiggler's here. We're gonna be playing, we're gonna be versing him. So we have Wiggler, Daisy, Shy Guy, and Boo. Okay, so here's Chain Chomp Challenge. You have to throw tennis balls at the Chain Chomp. They'll give you one point. If you throw a Bob Bomb at a Chain Chomp, it'll turn into a Red Chain Chomp, and you'll get double the amount of points. However, if you throw if you throw a Bob Bomb at a Red Chain Chomp, it'll chase after you. Okay, Shy Guy hit my Chain Chomp. That was not me. The water bubbles. I should be calling them bubbles, not water balls. It's supposed to be water bubbles. They're bubbles, basically. If you throw a bubble at a red chain chomp, it'll go back to a regular chain chomp. If you throw a water bubble at a regular chain chomp, it'll fall asleep. To wake it up, you throw a bob bomb at it, basically. See, Wiggler's chain chomp fell asleep. So the goal is to get the most points. You have to try to beat your opponents. Apparently, I'm in third at the moment. And you're, like, given a few minutes, like three or two minutes. Oh, my God. Shy guy, why are you hitting my chain chomp? Hit your own. Yeah, sometimes your opponents can even hit your own chain chomps. It's stupid. I, and it's kind of lagging because there's lots of lots of action going on on the screen. That's pretty much why. <laughs> Shy guy's chain chomp fell asleep. So yeah, as long, so I'm so yeah, I'm gonna be. T I'm just gonna toss the bob bombs aside once the chain chomp turns red. That's basically the strategy you want to do. So if you're, so if you're a. Uh, if your chain chomp's red, if you and, it, and you see a bob bomb coming, just toss the bob bomb aside. And I think I just helped shy guy out there. So yeah, 
I don't want, so yeah, I'm, I only want to hit tennis balls at it. I don't want any water bubbles or, or I don't want any bubbles or uh, bob on hitting it because remember what they do. Here you go, shy guy. <laughs> I literally helped shy guy. Shy guy, you should be thanking me. I helped you out. Oh, shy guy. Is that how you respect me? You just make my chain chomp fall asleep? And I notice we're in first place. We're doing really well. I'm surprised. Okay, well, come on, come on. Wiggler's kind of close to us. Come on, come on. We can I think, yeah, I think we won this, guys. This is easy. Yeah, this game's kind of easy. It's nice. Shy guy, how dare you? And flood makes it and there we go yep we easily won that 76 points nice that was really easy that was peckish chomp or that was chain chomp challenge and it's nice because it shows all the characters on the results screen not just yours probably because it's a versus thing and then we unlocked uh, the next difficulty all right that's chain chomp challenge let's go on to the next one so next up we have Blooper Blooper Volley. We'll be Koopa Troopa because he's another character we haven't seen. Buddy Blooper. How is it a coincidence that Yoshi and Koopa both have not been seen in tournament mode when they're default partners? Wow. All right, so here's how you play Gooper Blooper. Just a refresher. Again, I'll tell you how to play it again. So basically what you have to do, you have to avoid hitting the X's. Because if you hit an X, it's automatically game over. And I, I think if you also miss the ball, it's game over too. So that really stinks. Sometimes there will be two X's and even three. So there's only one spot to aim for when that happens. So you want to be careful. The goal is to uh, get, try to get, try to reach the goal. So we need 20. So we need 10 more already. And we're doing okay. So yeah, we have to try to avoid the X's. In the Wii version, you're given strikes. In the GameCube version, you don't get any strikes. That That's only for the Wii version. So in the Wii version, if you miss the ball or hit the X, you're given a strike. So in the Wii version, it's easier because you're given three strikes. Which, wow. And and you know that when you... And we completed that easily. And you know that when you... Uh, there's like three tennis balls seen in the corner, basically. And there's Blooper Blooper Volley. We did it. So yeah, we actually completed that. That was nice. So yep, that's Blooper Blooper Volley. Let's go on to the next one. So next up we have, um, we're going to be my boy Wiggler. We're going to be him on Balloon Panic. So it takes place on the DK Jungle Court. I don't know why they call the Gooper Blooper one the Gooper Blooper Court. I usually call it Rico Harbor Court. Any anywho. We're on Balloon Panic. So you have to try... This one might be a little tricky, but you have to try... So we, we have to try to get 10 Kremlings to escape. You cannot... You have to try to avoid... You have to try to avoid having the Kremlings pop the balloons. Because if, if, if the Kremlin pops any of the balloons, it's game over. So the goal is to try to... You have to try to flip the panels... So a Kremlin can go a certain way. So wherever wherever the vines go, the Kremlin will travel. So we already made one escape. And it's kind of difficult because wherever you want to aim it, sometimes the ball won't go that way. So that's kind of that kind of stinks. I don't know why it's like that, but it's stupid. Really, it's really stupid. Oh, come on. Uh-oh. That one. Come on. Oh, my God. And I like how it says the word, the name DK right there on the on the court itself too. And there, you got Kremlings like making noises, cheering for you. And there's a couple toads sitting on barrels. The red toad, either the red toad or the, and we already lost. Either the red toad or the blue toad throws tennis balls at you or to you. You know, let's try that again. I did not mean to press game over. Why do I keep hitting exhibition mode? You know what? Let's try that again. Maybe we'll maybe we'll try it. Maybe we'll do better. I don't know. Let's just try. 
Let's try this again. See, it's nice how toads are also here. Lakitu's the one holding up the, the sign, basically how many you need. I don't know why it's holding its hand out like that. So yeah, apparently, I thought the game is, I thought it was game over when both of your balloons pop. I thought it was like that, but no, it's not. If only, if one of the balloons pop, it's already game over. I thought it would be if both of them popped. And I thought the balloons would be like acting like lives. So if one of the balloon pops, it's already, it's, uh, it's not game over yet. You have to wait till the other one pops, but apparently it's not like that. Oh, not again. Well, I guess Balloon Panic is not one of my games. Well, we tried. I'm sorry, guys. At least we tried. Sorry, Wiggler. Alright. We'll be Daisy next. We'll... How about we... Okay, we'll... We're gonna do Mega Bowser Mayhem. Taking place on the Bowser Castle Court. We have Mega Bowser from Super Mario Sunshine here. So, you have to defeat him. And apparently this one can be hard. So you have to avoid bullet bills and bob bombs And the bullet bills drive me insane. Oh my god. And he also breathes fire too. Sorry about that, guys. Sorry if you heard that knocking. Um, anyways. So yeah, you have to try to avoid, uh... You have to try- you have to try to avoid, uh... You have to try to avoid the attacks. Oh my god, we're already not doing good. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this one. Oh no. Come on, we got this. Yeah, our health's getting pretty low already. The bullet bills are driving me insane, so you have to try to throw the, the bob bombs and bullet bills back, I believe, at him. But I'm trying to do that, but apparently I'm struggling with that. Okay, there's a mushroom. There's a mushroom. Mushrooms, I think mushrooms give you an extra boost, I believe. Come on, come on. Hold on, let's see. Hmm, let's see. Oh, there's also- oh yeah, it increases speed, and then the star- there can also be a star as well. And I want the star to appear. So I'm trying to see if I can throw them back. Oh, great. Okay, that was really difficult. Uh, well, I guess we'll try again, just in case. It's always good to try again sometimes. Hopefully we can do better. I don't know. I'm hoping. <laughs> Daisy's, no Daisy's like, clips there. It's, it's, it's funny what, he, what she says. She's like, whatever. I'm so sure. Well... So yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens here. Um, the bullet bills hit you so easily. Like, why? Why is it like that? The only thing that's hitting him is my attacks, my own attacks. Like, I'm trying to get bob bombs and bullet bills to hit him, but it's not doing anything. Just come on. Come on, come on, come on, you can do it. Come on. Oh my god, come on, he- I can see he's halfway there, he's halfway there, we're halfway there. Oh my god, now we have less than him! Oh, this is- this mini game is so hard! I am trying so hard, guys. I am trying so hard to beat this, but apparently it ain't working. Ugh. No! Oh, so we were so close! We were really close! Oh well, we tried. Alright, I believe there's one more game, so I guess we'll show it off. And we are gonna be Mario for this. Our last game is Coin Collectors. It takes place on the... Mario Classic Court, my favorite court in the whole entire game. 
So here we go. Here's Coin Collectors. This has to be one of my favorite mini games. All right, here we go. So the goal is to get as you have to try to get as many you have to try to get the goal amount of coins, and you're only given a, a whole minute to complete it. There's some things you have to avoid. If the ball hits the power block, you'll be moving up. Stars give you invisible power. You have to try to avoid the fireballs because they'll, they'll rise you up on a platform just like you saw Wario there. Pretty hilarious. Um, mu and mushrooms make you go fast, basically. It's always nice to stay in the back, though, because you'll get... So the goal is to get to 1,000. When there's already almost 20 seconds left? Oh, my God. Oh, also, lightning makes the, the player shrink, except the user. Kind of like Mario Kart, you know? I like the elements. There's sidesteppers, Koopas. I don't know why in the advanced game they replaced them with spinies. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Can we get it? Can we get it? Can we get it? Can we get it, please? Oh, my God. Are we going to get it? Uh, come on. <gasps> oh, my God. Exactly 1,000. Oh, my God. But what do you know? We completed it. Wow. Whew, that was close. All right, well, that's all the special games, guys. I might show up ours on the court again. I want to thank you all so much for watching my whole Let's Play of Mario Power Tennis. Hold on, guys. So, yeah, what do you, would you look at that? So, yeah, I might redo that at some point, too. I want to thank you all so much for watching my playthrough of Mario Power Tennis. It took a whole entire month to complete, but we finally completed it because today's the last day of April and we started this on April 1st. Thank you all so much for watching. I will probably start the new Let's Play on Mario Superstar Baseball probably Friday or something. You might want to stay tuned. Thank you all so much for watching. The next video will probably be on Wednesday for the start of the Bowser Tour 2023 Mario Kart Tour. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my whole Let's Play. We covered everything. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. All right, let's try this again. Yep, I, um, if you remembered, I was going to do a redo of, uh, if you all remembered, I was going to do a retry of Artists on the Court real quick. So let's see how we do. Do you think this time we'll be able to complete it? Because I, I think I learned how to get the ball to the top now, so let's see how we do. Okay, we got that colored in. I'm just hoping we can maybe complete this this time. I want to I wanna complete the Mario picture. I really do. See, now we were, able, we were finally able to color the hat in, but it's the wrong color, so... Now he has a blue hat. To be fair, that is the color hat of my... My boyfriend's OC of Mario makes sense, but it's the regular Mario, so it has to be red. Oh my god, so yeah, we actually got the two that we were missing last time. Like, what do you know? Okay, come on, come on. Let's not lose focus. Okay, we just need the nose and the eyes. Wrong nose color. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Oh my god, we can do this. Okay, we just need the eyes. We just need the eyes. We just need both. Okay, oh, oh my god. Okay, we just need this one eye. We just need this one eye. We got this. We got this. We got this. Stay focused. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay, we need this one eye. We need it. We can do this. We have about three minutes until we complete it. Three minutes, guys. We got this. Come on. Come on, we got this. Don't lose focus here. Come on, come on, come on. I'm trying so hard. I'm trying the different techniques. I'm trying 
I'm trying to do what I learned. Come on, we, we can get this eye. We can get it. We can get it. We were, we were able to get it last time. Come on. Come on, come on. We got this. Come on. We come on. I like how the top of the board is like a window. It's funny. And we're using paintballs too. This is a good mini game. I'd play I'd do better on the Wii version though. Oh come on. Hey, at least if you finish a picture and you put another paintball on it, it doesn't turn to that color. It just stays the it stays the correct color. Let me look at the controls once again. Okay. Come on. Come on, come on. We got this. Oh. Ugh. we can make it oh hold on yeah I'm just doing that real quick just in case I don't know why but I'm probably gonna delete that save slate anyways if I do complete this come on come on we got 43 seconds come on don't lose focus on. We got this. Yes! Finally! We did it! Yay! Oh, we finally completed it. Yes, let's go! And look at that, the Luigi one's here. But we're not going to be able to do it, so. Thank you all so much for watching my Let's Play of this game. This is Today Girl 20. See you guys later.